Boy, it's been a rough week for folks here at Hamden High School on Monday, about 100 feet from where we're standing now, just off campus. Two freshman boys got into a fist fight and then one stabbed the other. And then last night, well, some students flagged a social media post. The social media posts that raised eyebrows used racial slurs and a swear in saying that someone was planning to shoot up Hamden High School today. We immediately um, had a meeting with the Board of Ed and a decision was made with the police department, the Board of Ed and the mayor's office to close school. And the unrest is something that has been building all week at Hamden High, the chief says. Based on um, rumors of through the week of a uh, possible fight on Friday. Chief Sullivan called Thursday night's post a warning rather than a threat. There are a lot of um, freshmen actually who are um, having a difficult time this year. And, and really, if we look at what um, they've been through in the last couple of years. Both the mayor and police chief say COVID has definitely had an impact. Plus, the school has seen numerous unsettling incidents of late. We did have a rough patch. Uh, there's been a few incidents that uh, we've handled uh, at the school. Including October 5th, when a Hamden High student was found with a loaded 45 caliber gun in his backpack. Then earlier this week, two freshman boys got into a fist fight at a bus stop just off campus after dismissal. And that's when one stabbed the other. And I think that's playing into the uh, decision making process of having the school closed today for uh, just out of an abundance of caution at this point. Now, coming up for you on the Fox 61 News at 5, next hour, we'll tell you why this particular series of incidents uh, is especially disturbing to Hamden's new mayor. It's very close to home. We're live here in Hamden. Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.